I guess, you know, being the first game, there was always going to be um, that, that challenge to see, um, you know, what would happen. But, you know, I felt, I felt comfortable out there and um, I think it showed, you know, from the way I run routes to um, the way I handle the ball and, um, you know, picking up blitzes as a whole, you know, for me, there's a whole bunch of things that, um, you know, I need to get not only used to, but need to get better at as well. So, you know, for me, um, it's about just working on those things, you know, those areas. And, it, and it's the whole thing, you know, it's not just one or two things I need to work on. It's just, you know, pretty much everything, you know, as, as a running back and as a um, kick returner. You know, there's, you know, huge amounts of excitement back in Australia and definitely friends and family that, um, you know, that have been along for the journey as well. You know, they're, they're ecstatic not only, you know, to see me play, but to, I guess to, to see me do well. And, um, you know, obviously it's a, a huge thing. Um, you know that I that I've done with with taking that that chance, and so um, you know they, they they find a lot, a lot of joy in it as well, probably a bit more than me. So obviously you want to make smart decisions, but uh, Jared is fearless, and that's that's one of the characteristics that it takes to be a great punt returner. Uh, he is fearless, and uh, you know it's it's fun. You know when you can see a guy that can make that first guy miss. And he's not scared because he's very, very comfortable fielding the ball. And uh, when you have that fearlessness, it definitely gives you an edge on your opponent. He's a talented guy. I mean, and obviously, you don't want to have talented guys on your roster. So, you know, it just, we'll see how it all shakes out. Uh, you know, and he's a joy to coach. He's just a, you know, a hardworking guy.